Scorpio. <laughs> What's up, Scorp? last one for the day. Give me clear, precise reading for the sign of Scorpio. Oh, please can't be standing stagnant or negative energy. Please send back any spell work or evil eye back to the center times 100. In Jesus' mighty name. Please bless Jesus from the crown of my head to the of my feet. And for the name God of me, of Scorpio, and for cross watch. Scorpio, you might you might um notice uh, a bigger presence around you, right? You might feel like a bigger energy around you. Okay, two, three, four, I'm just talking about yourself. Um, you got new people being added to your spiritual team. Okay, two, four, two on the time. So uh, just be pay attention. You know. Gonna be getting direct communication. Direct, like you haven't experienced it yet. So don't be startled, okay? <laughs> don't be startled. And look at that. Scorpio. Y'all see that? Can you hear it? There we go, Scorpio. <laughs> we'll start there. Alright, this is a Scorpio reading. Alright. Somebody could be named Nalia. Nalia, Nalia. Okay, I just saw three, three, three at a time. Military energy weapons. Okay, so uh, they got these weapons, right? And, and this has been used on me before, okay? I was just sitting in my bed one day. Uh, this was like at least six months back, right? I was sitting in my bed one day, and all of a sudden I started to feel nauseous, right? So I feel this nauseousness. And you know, you like fight nauseousness or whatever, right? Or your mouth gets watery and you're about to throw up, you know, and you, you're fighting it, you're trying to keep it down, right? And I just had that, that same feeling. And I'm just like, you know, I know I didn't eat anything wrong, right? I didn't drink anything I was supposed to, right? There was no reason for me to be feeling nauseous or having the feeling that I needed to throw up, right? Um, it wasn't until, I think a couple of days later, well, I found out about military energy weapons, okay, and that they were being used on me for three, two on a timer. So, that might have happened to you, right? Or it could be happening to you now, right? There are people that they send to your neighborhood, middle of the night, 444 on a timer, park outside your house, use these energy weapons, okay, and you wouldn't even know it. You wouldn't even know it. You know, it's a real thing. Four, five, six on the time. Very real thing, okay? Because you are an earth angel. They know who you are. They've always known who you are, okay? Since birth. 
police officer. Came out in the reverse, okay? Um, there could have been some type of corrupt police officer that was uh, being paid to watch you, okay? They're no longer watching you, okay? Because they got problems of their own to deal with now, okay? Somebody, yeah, they tried to lower or weaken your angelic protection, okay? No such thing. No such thing. Somebody could be named Jackson. From Jackson. You could be from Jackson, Mississippi, okay, or somebody can. Um, somebody could be from Jacksonville, Florida, okay. I'm here in Duval County. Puerto Rico. Might be from Puerto Rico, live in Puerto Rico, or be Puerto Rican 555 from the time. Might be air sign, okay, air bend, all right. Or, um, you're getting your thoughts aligned, okay, more aligned, you're feeling more uh, structured, okay, in your mind. You might be watching me from Africa. What's up? What's up, Africa? Shout out, Africa. Shout out, okay. I see y'all. I see y'all in the comments. What's going? What's good? The boy's mind by Monica and Brandy. <laughs> Somebody wanted what you had so badly, and then they got it, and they realized that they did you a favor. <laughs> they realized they did you a favor, okay? Instead of actually trying to take something from you or someone from you, they did you a favor. <laughs> you dodged a bullet. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Somebody could be a Pisces, okay? Or this could have been a Pisces, all right? Um, somebody can be really, really in their emotions right now over you, good or bad. Ooh, uh, came out in reverse. Somebody got into the divorce or getting one, okay? And somebody else is getting married. Oh, it's similar. <laughs> I thought I've seen another name. There's only one letter different, but uh, uh, Khalil. Somebody give me name Khalil. Okay, it did come out in the reverse. Okay, seven thirty-seven. So for me, this means this actually means something else. Like uh, uh, this is one letter off from my ex's name, um, and this lets me know that they're <laughs> being handled spiritually. Okay. Lazarus come forth, okay, came out in the reverse, okay. <laughs> I just heard, uh, Lauren Hill said, make you want me, right, um, the ready or not song. Uh, so somebody tried to force something back to life with you, okay, um, <laughs> that they had no power to do so. Okay, so that Lazarus come forth, okay? Mm -mm, mm -mm. No, 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 no. Those things stay dead. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Somebody could be named, uh, well, somebody could be named Nala, right? It's from The Lion King. Um, came out in reverse. So somebody that tried to walk in your, I'm talking to Divine Feminine right now, somebody who tried to walk in your divine feminine energy, right? Um, they've been found out, right? They, they, right? Because remember Nala, you can think of her as like a queen, right? Or a, a princess at the time, right? When she's, when she's younger, right? But she grew up to be a queen, right? She's Simba's, Simba's counterpart, right? 919 on the timer. So this person tried to act as who they thought, well, Act as your person's divine counterpart, right? Play the role of being you, okay? And they were quickly found out, okay? Quickly found out. Okay, we get that one. I'll stop right there. So, same reasons. fell out. I'm going to take that one too because somebody needs to hear that. Okay. Oh, you know what? Here, I'll pick these four.
person, then our woman dies. <laughs> a nice roll out the bag. Seven. I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> Divine perfection and completion, number seven. Seven is often associated with divine perfection and completion. It is believed to represent the harmonious union of the spiritual and material worlds, embodying a sense of wholeness and fulfillment. Okay, so something has come to a completion. Divine perfection and completion. Something has reached its peak, its perfected state. Okay. So I need to go back to the chart. Okay, so this sign is Mercury. Okay, Mercury. This sign is Ooh, this one's a little harder. Where is it? see it. It's not on this chart. Okay. So, let's go again. Aries. Aries, the number 10. <laughs> Virgo. Aries and Virgo. Okay. Sorry, that's significant for me. Um, Sagittarius and Mercury. Okay. The number seven and the number ten. Okay, so we did the number seven. Okay, something has come to a divine, perfect, perfected, and completed state. Okay, so it's telling me it is time for the beginning of a new journey, so to speak. Okay. 10. Holds significant spiritual meaning in various cultures, numerology, astrology, and religious texts. It symbolizes completion, perfection, and the duality of existence. Across different traditions, the number 10 offers spiritual lessons on balance, harmony, and the in interconnectedness of all things. So somebody, or a pair, okay, have completed their round of lessons in their separation. They've learned how interconnected they are, not to only each other, but to everything in existence. Okay. They are the duality to each other as well as everything else in existence. Hmm. Okay. All right. 710. Got that. Uh, Mercury. Let's set that Mercury.
Education, intellect, curiosity, adaptability, and versatility. Mercury is often associated with communication, intellect, curiosity, adaptability, and versatility. It's placement in the nail chart and transits through the zodiac can provide insight into a person's mental abilities, learning style, communication skills, and more. So one of one of you has taught the other one or taught through action, right? Um, through uh, a living example, okay, has taught the other person their mirrored capabilities, okay, the capabilities that they have within themselves, right? The same things that one person um, admires in the other person, the person that's doing the admiring has the same capabilities, the same things within themselves that they admire about their person, okay? And it's teaching them how to love the same things that they love about their person, about themselves, right? As well as the same things that might annoy them about their person, they can find within themselves, okay? That annoy them about themselves, okay? So this has come to a completion. Okay. Sorry, it's Aries and Virgo. Just kidding. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. So, first card out. Wisdom. The fool doth think he is wise, but the wise man knows himself to be a fool. Okay. It might have been one time or another, right, in our lives where we thought we knew everything or we thought we knew more than everybody else, right? Somebody has learned that nobody knows everything, right? We all really know nothing but uh, what we are learned, uh, what we are learned, what we are taught through experience along the way in our journey, right? And... what we attribute through spiritual lessons. That's the first step to, to being able to be taught, right? To admit to yourself that you, you, you don't know everything, right? And that's something obvious, unless you have like a really toxicity problem or a really, what is retrograde, I swear. <laughs> a toxicity problem, or you are a just raging narcissist, like, you know, um, it should be like of common sense to know that, hey, I, you know, there's no way that I can know everything. There's no way. If, if that was the case, then <laughs> what am I doing here? You know, what, what am I doing here on Earth? Why am I here? Earth is a school. Okay. It is a school, right? The matrix is a womb. That is what it is, a womb. What happens in the womb? You, the baby grows, right? It's familiar, starts to, you know, move and hear and see. And, well, maybe not see because they're in the womb, but you, you get the gist, right? So somebody is w realizing um, that they don't know as much as they thought they did, right? And then coming, in, coming to realize that um, they're gaining wisdom, right? I'm seeing 1111 right now on this box over here by my door. So, uh, <laughs> you might be tired of me saying twin flame, but hey, I can't help it. I can't help it, all right? If it don't apply, then let, let it fly, all right? Black Pearl, this is the first time this one came out since I had the deck. Gluttony, he who is not content with what he has would not be contended, would not be contended with what he would like to have. Ooh, okay. Let me read that again. Oh, okay. Thank you, Spirit. So, if you're not content with, if you don't learn how to be content, right? Remember I was talking about that earlier in one of the past readings? 
right? I learned how to be content in whatever situation or part of my life that I find myself in, right? Um, I don't focus on what I don't have, right? And it, and it took a while. It took a while, it did. But I don't focus on what I don't have, right? What, uh, you know, I don't compare myself to others. Um, I do not think about the negatives, right, on um, what I want and don't have, right? How do I say this third? If you do not learn how to be content, okay, with where you find yourself in the moment, okay, being in the moment, okay, then gaining things, right, people, whatever it is, is not going to make you content either. There it is. Thank you, Spirit. Okay, if you cannot find uh, or, or develop a nature of being content wherever you are and whatever position you're at, it, it, the things that you think that you need or want, they're not going to make you feel any more content either. They're not. You're going to feel like you need more or, or something else, right? And you first have to be content within yourself, like with yourself, you know? So, and that can go any, that can go each way for, for each person, right? Any way for each person. Um, but the base message is the same for everybody, okay? Carnelian, isn't that the... <laughs> it is! Look at that! Look at that! This came with one of my bracelets. <laughs> Same one. Uh, that wasn't it by mistake. Okay, goodness, look at the spirit. Okay. I'm going to tell you what this is because it's not on here. Carnelian is an energizing gemstone that stimulates creativity and instills confidence. Okay, it says energizing creativity and confidence at the bottom. <laughs> and the word is explore. Come on now. Spirit does things on purpose, man. Explore, dream, discover. 20 years from now, you will be more disappointed by the things that you didn't do than by the ones you did do. So throw off the Oh, so throw off the bow lines, sail away from the safe harbor, catch the trade winds in your sails, explore, dream, discover. Somebody is overcoming the fear of change, right? And and they they've started to discover themselves, right? And in discovering themselves, twenty three, twenty three on the timer, and discovering themselves, right? That opened them up to discover, right, in every way possible, in every way possible. Now, their their discovery, you know, is awoke, awakened, two, three, four, five on the time. Their discovery is awakened. You get what I'm saying? Like, they're thinking about, remember I said, I, I say this all the time, remember I said the thing that I'm afraid of is regret? I don't like the feeling of regret, right? Like, Thinking back on something and not taking the chance, right? Not taking the leap of faith, right? Always having a thought in my mind, what if I would have? You know what I'm saying? Like, that is something that will eat away at you, just chip away. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. So I made a promise to myself that I would never allow myself to be sitting in the energy of regret. Not if I have anything to do with it. Nope. 24-24 on the timer. Nope. So somebody is feeling that same way. Okay? Somebody's feeling that same way. They don't want to regret something. They don't want to let something pass by them. Which is good. 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 Mm. Sorry. I know something. <laughs> I know something and I'm trying to act like I don't know something.
feeling all my excitement. I'm feeling somebody else's excitement too. Oh, somebody feel like they can't breathe when you when you talk to them. Like you take their breath away, take their breath away. Leave retrograde. Leave. <laughs> Leave. Give me my tongue back in the way that you found it. I hope y'all like the way I'm doing this now. Like, spirit let me to. I like it. We'll add some more things later and take away, add, take away, you know. But I like it. Give y'all as much information as possible. One more. Your person is. Mm. I'm sure you can feel the sexual tension. The song I want is uh, Touch Me, Tease Me. Foxy Brown and uh, Oh, by Case. True, excuse me. I was about to say JC. <laughs> Foxy Brown and Case. Only one I need. Body make me feel. The way you make me feel. And you know it's love and clear. Ten of Wands. I'm about to see 11 11. Come on now, it don't end. I'm telling you. I'm not doing this. <laughs> I'm not, okay? <laughs> the world, 21. Number 21. Look. 11 11. Mother the twin may be talking to me. Ten of swords. Somebody feels backstabbed. 10 10. Then 10 10. 10 10. Somebody's pissed off. Eight of Pentacles. Yup. Somebody's pissed off. 28 28 on the time. 10 10 again. What? What? Come. Do you see what I mean by the frequency of the synchronicities? Somebody's mad that the spiritual uh, work that they did is not working. Mm -hmm. It's not working. They're trying to stop this... Uh, this new start from happening between uh, twin flames. This is a false twin trying to stop a twin flame reunion. Mm -hmm. And it is, it is no coincidence that this uh, Seal of Solomon, aka Star of David, is in the middle right here of these two cards. Right smack dab in the middle. This is bloodline. This is uh, royal lineage coming together. Ace of Pentacles. Four of Swords. Whoever this person, this this false twin, okay, catalyst twin, is what it is. Uh, this catalyst twin 
I mean, they spent all their money. They went broke trying to do this um, this spell work or pay for it at least. Uh, and yeah. So they dug a hole that they can't get out of. Now they're trapped in it. And that's how they start the, their new cycle. So this person tried to go, this person tried to pay a practitioner to force their healing, to force healing, right, this this Catalyst Twin. They tried to force their healing in order to present themselves to this Divine Masculine, thinking that that would change their mind, right? You cannot force healing, you, you, it, you have to do the work, you have to do the work, period. It's coupled with lesson learning. You have to, you cannot, no, 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 no. <laughs> the rules of the universe are in place for a reason. And everybody must follow them. Or there's consequences and repercussions to that. A lot of love songs coming on. in the world please four wands and number 13 again oh thank you Karen, wow, I pulled that out. Dang. Sorry, I got a <laughs> request for a reading here. That's crazy. Um, Queen of Pentacles, Death, and uh, Page of Swords. 33, 33 on the time. I tell you this masculine is fighting fighting to get to their divine masculine they are fighting I've never seen this before could be a, a Sagittarius Leo Aries okay um, Pisces Cancer Scorpio Towards Virgo Capricorn. Could be Libra Gemini Aquarius, a little, little, little bit.
person may have took a hit um, to their finances uh, because of this person that they were connected with. This person they were connected with or married to could have been, okay, uh, however they were together. They drained them spiritually, okay, mentally, every, every which way possible. They drained them. masculine couldn't figure out why they were so drained at times like why like it's this 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 witch was tapping into his his sacred energy because she was connected to his, his sacred sacral energy as long as he kept um, having you know sex with her right it would kind of like further that that uh, hold Right, that she had on him. This masculine realized it through you. They, uh, they watch you. They watch you, okay? And that's how they realized what was going on. Mm hmm. This, this, this witch watches you too. She watches you too. The magician. Yeah. You guys, if you guys want personal readings, um, if you send money through, email me too. Okay? I, I need your... I need your email, okay? Like, so I can contact you and stuff and send you the link and everything. And I need your birthday, right? Okay? I don't need it, right? But I like to have it, okay? Um, so I can connect to your energy better. One Woman Man by Dave Hollister. Yeah, this masculine's been working like uh, seven of wands. Yeah, they've been in their mind, right? Or the way they feel about it, you guys like you guys are together already. Like that's how they're acting in their energy, right? Um, so they are not involving themselves with people that they don't need to, right? That they're not supposed to. They're not doing things that they're not supposed to, right? Not involved in activities they're not supposed to be involved in, right? They are acting as though they already have you, which is what they're supposed to do, right? I don't know if they know that, but they're implementing it. They're implementing it. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Their intuition is on. On. On my dog. Um, could be a Scorpio in here, Aquarius. Libra, Gemini. Page of Wands, Three of Swords, and the Devil. Sorry, y'all. My Virgo missed that.
person is, uh, I don't know what the heck they got, I'm getting to think maybe, they're playing with something, they're, they're real, like, I won't say obsessive. Okay, obsessive, thank you, spirit. All right, okay, okay. They're obsessive about them having broke your heart, okay? And in turn, uh, you know, breaking your heart, they broke theirs, so, um, they know exactly how they make you feel, and they don't like that they broke broke your heart. So it's they're kind of obsessing over mending what they caused. Dang, I just noticed that he's major. The Hierophant. The sun, Ace of Wands, the tower. That's some power, boy. And the, the sun is number 19. The tower is 16. That's mirroring. That, that mirroring numbers. Didn't I tell you about the frequency of the synchronicity? 4, 3, 2, 1 on the timer. to be like this is meant to be for real i never seen a reading like this ever Devil. Okay. The Hierophant. One five five. Twenty judgment. Page of Pentacles. Seven of Cups. Justice.
so this which Okay, so this this kitchen witch, okay, is trying to whatever work that they're trying to do on this masculine, they're trying to keep them in heartbreak. Okay, they're trying to keep them in a um, victim victim o victim mentality. So that they won't move, so they'll be stuck. Okay, but I don't feel that doing anything. This masculine is on the move, okay? He's came out in too many readings and with too much fire in his belly, okay? What's the... She's trying to tap into his subconscious and control his thoughts. Okay, so it's like when when she's trying to keep him from watching you because that's how he's learning and have been learning. So she's trying to make it to where every time he goes to watch you, right? Um, every time she he goes to watch you, there's like some type of hook activated, like some type of hook that she's tried to like or well, that she's been pulling this masculine back by, right? Um, every time that he watches you, something kind of conflicts with his mental, right? To get him to stop watching you. It's not, it's not working. Yeah, I'm trying to confuse him, right? To a one, I'm trying to confuse him, which, well, I'm getting the energy of two of swords, but... You know, two of wands is, 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 you know, making a, you're, you're deciding to go in a, in a certain direction. She doesn't want him to tell the truth. Ace of Cups. Four of Cups, Ace of Cups. She may have been putting putting stuff in his drink without him knowing it. I feel like this is the past. Like past energy. It doesn't it the the, the, the love the love is too strong. The love is too strong. No matter what she's done or tried to do, it, it doesn't hold. It doesn't hold. The love is too strong. The Empress. Cup, 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 cup. The lovers. Three of Wands. Come on now. The love is too strong. <laughs> it's too strong. Love is the strongest. God is love. So what does that tell you? It is the strongest energy that there is in the universe. Okay. Okay, so... This Ace of Cups and it's Four of Wands. Let's move along here. Okay, Nine of Swords. Eight of Cups. Which way is that? Which way is that? Pentacles and Four of Pentacles.
this fem this feminine this kitchen witch may be going to jail for stealing. to it. Okay. Me one more. Ha ha yeah. <laughs> Three cups. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Mm -mm. Ain't nothing she can do about it. This man's been holding on for their life. Okay. The hermit. <laughs> the hermit 54. 54. Oh, sorry. I was about to call her number, but I didn't. Who's coming in for singles? Seven of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, King of Wands. So let's see. Let's move these up here because I don't need those anymore. Okay, so singles, okay. Man has I have a, a King of Wands coming in, a fire sign, okay? It doesn't have to be, it could be Leo, uh, Sagittarius, Aries. Um, it could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This person's stable, okay? Um, they might come from old money, okay? Seven of Swords in the reverse. Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. King of Cups in the reverse. Mm, I don't like that. That uh, don't feel right. That don't feel right. Where? where? Just falling out unless I ask about it. Is it time when it's time? Okay, the star. That's better. Alright, Spirit, what is this new person coming in? Seven of Wands, Ace of Pentacles. The king of wands, didn't I? Didn't the empress at the bottom of the deck? Mm -hmm. Two of cups, justice, king of cups, baby. Okay, could be a uh, cancer Pisces Scorpio as well. I can't remember the signs that came out in the beginning. Feeling a little iffy, hangman. Yeah, not sure, not sure. Okay, but this one is honest. Yeah, and forthright. Mm hmm. Okay, so give me, give me the ending. What's the rest of it? Knight of Souls. 
doors. Okay, of course you got people trying to sabotage this. Okay, they're in conflict about it, but there's nothing they can do about it if they wanted to. Alright. Uh, whatever this is, it's protected. Okay. I'm really feeling like this is the earth sign. Don't have to be, but I'm feeling this. I'm feeling. The person's well tempered. Like their energy is like it's angelic. Perfect word to describe it. It's angelic. That's what it feels like. It just it's just feels like it feels like my energy <laughs> it feels familiar it feels like my energy uh -huh. so both of you are going to be a little cautious you're going to be in your head about it right um that may be the healing the part of healing that you guys are going through right now separately before you even meet some of you may know this person already um for some of you, this could be a friend that never told you that they had feelings for you. Okay. But they've been chosen you. <laughs> and then wanted to take a leap of faith towards you. Okay. Towards my uh, six instinct work for deck for so I'm gonna pull a couple of those. Give it time, everything in divine timing, let things flow. Okay, so that goes in correlation with the healing that I said you guys are doing. Okay. Divorce, experiencing a breakup. We already we already talked about that, okay. Caution, find out more information. Don't overwork yourself. Okay, some of you guys need to balance a little bit better. Okay, balance a little bit better. You might be overworking yourself or um, maybe change your eating habits. Maybe cut back on a few things. Mercury retrograde, electronic issues, communication issues, review everything. Be careful of what you say in this time, okay? Be conscious of, uh, like, you know, someone make you angry or something or just be careful. Remember your retrograde, okay? Careful what you say. You don't want to say something you can't, you know, take back. Even if you didn't mean it. Everything fall out or flip over, please. Fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Tell the universe exactly what you want. Tell it. Or tell it. <laughs> Hold your vision, okay? 
hold your vision. Challenges, make a decision, work on inner healing. So further confirming, we're gonna talk about inner healing. Okay. Vacation. You will be traveling soon. Vacation. You better manifest that vacation. Honeymoon. <laughs> Honeymoon phase attending someone's wedding. Okay. Um, one on four, three, two. I saw the timer. So those of you that are um, still healing, okay. Don't romanticize when your person's gonna come in, okay? Let spirit do what spirit does. Focus on your healing. And don't force anything. One more. The floater will fall out, please, spirit. Liar, be careful, someone's sneaky. Okay. Yeah, past person, spying. Someone's got their eye on you. You were doing your research. Yeah, past person spying on you. Spying on this connection. Her brown noser. <laughs> this past person. Not my words. Okay. <laughs> we can fall out of the floor with spirit. <laughs> Remote viewing. viewing, okay, spying spy through spiritual means. <laughs> this person's trying to, trying to, this person's trying to prophesy, so like, they must be looking at, like, I don't know what they're, they're trying to mimic you, copy you, or something, thinking that since there's power in words that they can prophesy this not to happen. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. They're lying, they lying to themselves, okay? Lying to themselves. Spirit makes the floor fall out. Neptune, the urge to escape from limitation. <laughs> Somebody hauled ass, boy. Somebody hauled ass. They got a dream. Your person, uh, they got a dream. They got a dream. Okay, that if they didn't get up. The song so anxious is on by Jiggy One. This dream made this person anxious, beloved, anxious. They got up out of there. The divine showed them something, okay, that this person was up to. And they got ghost, as my grandpa would say. They got ghost. The urge to escape from limitations, transcendent, merging, and oneness. They got the heck out of there. Telepathy, that's what it was just at the bottom. Okay, spirit was telling me to say it. Okay, my bad spirit. My bad, I'm sorry. The ability to transmit or receive thoughts supernaturally. 
So your person is communicating with you, okay? If you're wondering if you're tripping, or no, your person's communicating with you, okay? Through music, through, you just check your environment, okay? Through animals and nature, pay attention, pay attention. You'll see it. <laughs> you will see it, one more. Service, eager and passionate to resolve problems of the whole world in the material, physical sense. Didn't I say earlier? Uh, yeah. Didn't I say how animate that this masculine was of fixing your broken heart, right? Or, you know, healing your broken heart, the part that they caused. Service. Mm -hmm. They're eager to fix what's between you guys. Very. And then you guys are going to work together to fix the, uh, not fix, but work together to heal, you know, the problems in the world, right? Uh, get people to wake up. So, cancer, that is your reading, okay? <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. Okay, this 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 is crazy. It's crazy. The synchronistic uh, confirmations is nuts. Um, but that's your reading, Cancer. Okay, hope you enjoyed it. All right, anybody want to donate? Description box. You already know what's that. All right, uh, personal reading. Description box as well. Right. Um, if you get a personal reading, okay, make sure you send me an email. Okay, please. Okay, because I ain't gonna be able to contact you. It's just gonna be just give me all your money, like, then, unless you want to, I don't know, but <laughs> I'd rather give you something in exchange, okay? Alright, so, I love you guys, Cancer, alright, I'll talk to y'all later.